So I'm just here at Myrtleford Golf Club in Victoria's Alpine region, admiring the beautiful trees and the scenery of this stunning golf course. But there's nothing stunning about these two balls in the rough uh, that I've hit off the tee here. So one, I do have a clear shot to the flag, uh, but it's on uh, top of a tree root, whereas the other one is this offending tree, the ball was right behind it. For most people, they're gonna see this and they're gonna go, okay, that's really unlucky. Uh, I'm just gonna to have to chip it out sideways or take an unplayable. For others, they're sort of blaming golf gods and the rules and that I don't get free relief because you, you don't get free relief from uh, when your ball has got interference from a tree root. A tree root is basically the same as the offending pine there, the, the tree. So these are both players at lies situations or you can take an unplayable for a penalty of one. Now, a committee can adopt a local rule for tree roots in the fairway or very close to it. Uh, that's certainly not, not a recommendation for the rough, a situation like this where you're not even close uh, to the green. So it's either, as I said, players at lies or take an unplayable. Um, I'm just gonna have a go here with my trusty five iron. 